Hey everyone, we're back this week with our horizontal shaft system. Last week we reviewed the vertical shaft system. And let me tell you the amount of phone calls, uh, the orders, the interest was just phenomenal. That was exactly the reaction I was hoping for when I introduced this vertical shaft system. Thank everyone that called. I love talking about this. I will talk to you guys all day. So call anytime if you have any questions about either one of these. I can tell you anything you want to know. Also, I want to say again on this video, uh, just to make super clear, thank you to anyone that's watching this that helped me get to this point. All right, so let's move in to the horizontal system. Up top is our third coast performance custom air to air intercooler. Uh, that thing is awesome. It takes the, the heat coming off that turbo, drops it drastically, pumps cold air into there, same as it does on the vertical shaft. This one is you know forward facing, so it cools even better. On the back side, we have our steel flex fittings, again, to help with vibration. Um, we have our bracketry, you know, everything is super solid. It's not going anywhere. Uh, we have the turbo completely isolated, supported uh, with its own bracket away from the weight on the exhaust or anything. It is, it is all by itself and it's supported by its own bracket to take all the weight off the exhaust to help from, you know, the possibility of cracked manifolds, anything like that. And thank you guys uh, that helped with that design. Seems to be really, really solid. Um, and the hours we've put on a few of them so far, they have, man, they have held up. Uh, we haven't had a single issue. Like I said, this has been a lot of research and a lot of development, and this is where we're at now. Um, the same thing with the vertical shafts, everyone. Uh, you do not have to pull the heads off of it to put it on. It is the only system, vertical or horizontal, that is truly bolt-on. You just take your stock air filter cover off, air filter, and stock exhaust off, put our stuff on there, bolt it, and go. It is the only system to incorporate an intercooler. That's really our signature up there. Uh, you know, that was a custom thing, uh, custom cores that we had made, and it works phenomenal for these applications. The next thing that I want to go over is overall height profile. I kind of went over it last week, uh, said that I would review it again uh, when we revealed the horizontal shaft the system. The overall height of this is four and three quarter inches, and that's measured from the very, very top of this faceplate here. Your stop cover is three and a quarter, so you gained about an inch and a half of overall height profile. The Garrett Turbo in the back, we lowered it down. It sits just below the top height of the intercooler. We did a lot of that for protection and you like I said, to keep it as low profile as we could. I can't start this one up as much as I would love to, um, as it's not hooked up to anything. Uh, we'll be putting it on a boat. I'll be videotaping test runs. I'll be videotaping top speeds. You know, so stay tuned, follow the channel, um, like, subscribe, whatever, to stay uh, up to date on all that. But what I can do is kind of do a brief walk around that way you guys can see the rest of the system and kind of what we've done here and what really separates us apart. Let's see, I had to get my camera right. All right, intercooler, Garrett Turbo, uh, Steel Flex, stainless exhaust, stainless bracketry. As y'all can tell, that bracket there fully supports the weight of that turbo takes all the pressure off the exhaust manifold, uh, will prevent cracking or any kind of defects that could possibly happen with here. So not only did we combat vibration, we combated the weight of that turbo, fully supported it. Uh, this is a solid, solid, solid system. Um, other than that, there's really not much else. Um, you know, we can, we can come around to here. You guys can get a, a back view here, um, kind of what the open system looks like. You know, we put in steel braid, steel braid A-in lines right here. Um, 
you know, just to, for aesthetics. Um, like I said, that's, that's about it, everyone. If, uh, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out. If you want to test run one, you know, see how your boat will run with a turbo kit, see how you like it and stuff like that. We have a couple extras here. Bring your boat on down. You know, we'll go have a day on the water. Put, you know, put it on your boat at the boat launch and uh, go test run it. Go see what it's about. Um, you know, I want you guys to be comfortable with these before you decide to purchase one. Um, like I said, I, I, I really appreciate all y'all support. Um, you know, there's been a long time coming project and, uh, you know, we're, we're nearing its completion. I love it. Love everything about it. And it works great. So, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope I answered any questions that you may have about the system. If I haven't, feel free to call me. I would, I would love to talk to y'all. Um, and so maybe we can get one on your motor. All right, everyone, I'll let you know. I'll keep you updated on speeds and, uh, we'll just keep on going. All right.